Hello like-minded people. Welcome to my channel. I want you to feel at home, to feel comfortable here. Please remember to hit the like button when you come in. Subscribe if you haven't. Leave a comment and tell a friend and tell a friend to tell a friend. And please come back. You're always welcome. Thank you. Welcome to Passionately Intrigued Arts. This is Tracy. So I just wanted to show you the outcome of the outdoor rubber doormat that I painted on live with the acrylic paints that were mixed with some types of mediums. Um, I ended up trimming in the garnet color to bring it all together without, um, it's kind of subdued rather than using one of these bright colors or a black to outline it. So the last thing I need to do is, because I'm not sure how these paints will react out in the elements because they were mixed with Floetrol and GAC, probably, I probably won't have a problem, but I'm just going to coat this uh, with a couple coats of an indoor-outdoor um, protection. This is uh, clear, max, and it's a satin. I want it matte. I don't want it to shine, really. It's shining enough, but... I couldn't find any mat down in my basement. So I'm going to give it a couple coats of this, let it dry, and I am done with this. I am done. And if you didn't watch the live to see how I created this, I'm going to have it linked. If you'd like to watch it, I'd appreciate it. Well, it's kind of windy out here, so that's all you gotta do. Just go back and forth. You're up about six to eight inches away from your item that you're painting back and forth motion and cover all the bases and this dries rather fast and as you see being satin it really doesn't give it a shine which I don't want it to shine I don't want it to be shiny so I'm just going to come back again okay that is it I think it turned out beautiful. The colors really pop. That white stands out. So putting the second coat on each one of these, um, I even put a second coat on the burgundy just because um, it really lifted the colors out and make them stand out. Absolutely beautiful. Now it makes me want to do another one, but I don't have another one unless I go purchase one. And so following this short video will be the other floor mats that I've done that I could find pictures of for you to get examples of. Oh, one more little light coat. So, peace and love. Have a great day. I appreciate you. Thanks you all for coming into my live as I painted this. I appreciate each and every one of you and those who watch the replay as well. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment. And if you haven't hit the notification bell, that would be so awesome of you to do so. You can see what's up and coming next. Be blessed. Peace and love. Deuces, I'm out. Passionately Intrigued Arts is my YouTube channel. Tracy Sweet Touch Production is my business. If there's anything that you see on my channel here that you like, please let me know and I can make it for you. I create to sell for my business. Just let me know. All you have to do is ask. My email is in the description for you to contact me with your inquiries. Thank you. As always, I thank you for your time. I thank you for stopping by and much appreciation for your support. Click the notification bell for intriguing content. Thank you.